Hello everyone. I am in my pajamas. These are new pajamas and I had, I'm having a bad hair day. So I wore a hat and I decided to wear this headband because I took off the hat, obviously. And I just didn't know what to do. So I decided to put this on. It does have a crown. So, you know, it's all working. And I have my, um, of course, blinking little lights. And we'll go over into the other um, mirror, like always, and then we're going to go through kind of a collective haul and just some cool stuff that I've been wanting to show you. So we'll go over to the other mirror right now. Oh, well, you know, give me the, let me give you guys a haul. All right. These are my pajamas. They're brand new. I'm wearing my Hello Kitty slippers. These are from the 99 cent store. I picked up a pair in every color. And I love my hot pink Hello Kitty slippers. They're super comfortable. And these these pajamas I just put on right now. And yeah, they're super cute. I'm wearing my sports bra from the 99 cent store. And um, all right, we'll go over to the other mirror. All right, so now you can see me better. And this is really cute. My husband actually picked this up for me. It's V-neck. It's a size large. I like my pajamas to be nice and big and comfortable and so it's kind of long in the sleeves but that's okay and you have a bear which reminds me of my baby Ollie and you have snowflakes and you have a deer you have all this stuff and I'm pretty sure he got these at Big Lots because I saw them at Big Lots when we did one of our walkthroughs and I don't care they're from Big Lots and this is like I said a size large I'm not sure how much they were but is this not a cute gift tag or what? That is adorable. They're deer foams. Anyways, I think it's so cute. I don't even, I'm just gonna put it up somewhere. It's so cute. Anyways, that's me right now. And I'm just not feeling it today right now. It is only, it's 1.52 and I'm, I'm in my pajamas. Uh, I just, I don't feel good. And I did go out to a couple of 99s. And honestly, it's just, it's pretty dead. I mean, they're just pushing a lot of Christmas, a lot of Christmas. And since I've already decorated my house, I'm not going to just buy Christmas stuff just to haul. Um, that doesn't make any sense. And I have way too much Christmas stuff going on right now to be bringing in more Christmas items. The only time I bring in Christmas items is if I got something, you know, really awesome on clearance or if they're going to do it for free, which I'm pretty sure they're going to do it for free again. So I'm, um, this is my tip. All right. For the free Christmas, go to several of your different 99 cent stores and whichever 99 cent store has the best Christmas stuff still in stock like right now in my head there's two stores that i already know i i, I want to hit when they do their free because they have pillows i mean they literally have barely moved a lot of their christmas stuff and another thing too is once you figure out which store you want to hit know where stuff is like go in there the day before know like where the pillows are going to be or where the pictures are going to be or whatever you're going for whatever decor you're going for so that when those doors open, you have your basket and you already have a little map in your head because you know, okay, the pillows are over here. So I'm going to get these pillows and then I'm going to go over here. I'm going to go over there because people just go in a mad rush and they're pretty much just, I don't even know what they're doing. I don't even think they know what they're doing. They're just throw stuff in their cart and look later. Um, so that's why I just kind of like to go in with a plan. I go and get what I, what I want. So also, you know, make yourself a wish list and again, go and see how they're setting up because usually they'll start setting up like late at night. So you can go to like about eight, eight thirty, and kind of see like what they're doing. Um, anyways, those are my tips for Christmas because I really did not chase the free stuff for harvest. I just was not feeling it, but, um, there is some free stuff that I do want to get for Christmas. If it happens, great. If not, Hey, I tried. All right. Um, I still have not tried this yet. I know. I bought this for the holidays. I have not tried it. The Glimmer Rose by BB. And I still have not tried this. I don't know what's wrong with me. And I found these when I was cleaning out my closet because we were still donating more stuff. All right. There is some other stuff I want to show you. So I will be right back. Okay. So this is my new jacket. And no, this is not a Christmas present. This is just something that my husband bought for me. 
and it is a size small juniors i love it i love how these zippers are kind of like a neuter color and this is detachable but it is so nice and warm so you can wear it like as an all faux leather coat or you can put on this little fur thing which i'm going to keep the fur thing on and it is a size small so i don't mind it being a size small because it's nice and snug and I want to wear it with like um, tights or skinny jeans and cute boots over. Well, the boots that I got at Target, yeah. So that's what it looks like sideways. And here you can see it a little bit better. It's really cute. It is super warm, super comfortable. I love that the zippers are black. I've been wanting to wear this, but I have not filmed it, so I couldn't wear it. And we bought this when we went to Burlington, and it was $19.99. So really fun. And again, Burlington has a lot of really cool gifts for cheap because this was $19.99. So that's a gift under 20. And how cute is this BB sweater? I am in love with it. Look, at it is so nice and furry. And these sleeves are really, really long. Hold on. This is Crystal's like perfect sweater. It cinches in at the waist, which I love. And then it has really cool long sleeves that are nice and comfortable. And this sucker is warm. This is by BB. This was $24.99. And it does say originally, sorry, I'm trying to get close enough where I can see this. Oh my gosh, these tags. All right. It looks like it was originally, sorry you guys for doing this to you. Hold on. I just ripped the tag off. All right. Originally $79. Originally $79 and we picked it up for $24.99. So this is, I absolutely love, love this sweater. And again, I bought it when I went to Burlington or my husband bought it for me when we went to Burlington a couple weeks ago. And I haven't worn it because I didn't shoot it. <laughs> so that's how it looks sideways. And I'm going to be really honest with you. Right now, it has taken a lot for me to come on camera because... Right now I'm 150 pounds and I don't feel comfortable at this weight. And I know a lot of people are going to be like, it's water weight or, you know, it's only a couple of pounds because I'm used to being like 146, 144 to 146 is where I like to keep my weight. And at 150 pounds, I just feel super self-conscious. So I'm having a really hard time doing this try on haul because I'm just looking in this mirror and I'm just like, oh my gosh. But anyways, all right. Um, I think that's the last item that I purchased from Burlington. And again, these are not Christmas gifts. This was just stuff that I needed because I do need more winter stuff. And I think that's it. All right. So we're going to go into the other room and we're going to go through our hauls. My husband is super sweet. Um, during Christmas time, he gets a lot of gift cards and hold on. All right, I'm not going to lift it up because I don't want to show who it's from or my husband's name. But he does get a lot of gift cards at his job, and he is such a sweetheart. This one is from Bloomingdale's, and he just gave it to me. Um, I was, you know, and I asked him, I said, why are you giving this to me? Because if I was him, you know, I would have gone to Bloomingdale's and bought me a gift. <laughs> and, you know, surprised me with it and been like, look, babe, you know, I got you something at Bloomingdale's. But... He's not like that. He is just so, so sweet and generous with me that he just gave it to me. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Bloomingdale's and I'm going to see what nice gift I can get for him. So, you know, even if it's only a $25 gift certificate, obviously I'll be making up, you know, what the rest is. But I'm pretty sure I'm going to be going in there with going into the men's section. And hey, if I find something for myself too... Bonus. So that is one of the items I wanted to show you. All right. So we went to Walmart, I think on Saturday or something. I don't remember. And I have not put my tree topper because I didn't film it. So here's the tree topper that we picked. And this one is cool because it's multicolored, just like our lights. And honestly, I'm glad that we did hold out and go to Walmart because I think this was, this was super cheap. This was not anything expensive. Maybe it was $16, not sure, not sure, but 
it works and yay now we can actually put it up on the tree because i literally have been holding on to these and of course it's wax melt time all right i was really surprised because when i went to walmart guess what they didn't have any um seasonal wax melts for christmas and i was like what the fork you know um that's not cool so i got girlfriend night and this is bubbly berry bliss the value pack and it's red and i think i've had this before so we picked that up and cinnamon apples my husband picked this as easy as pie sensationals what's funny is i don't like cinnamon at all like i would never pick this but hey when you're married you just got to roll with it sometimes because my hubby picked it and hey, he wants it. We got it. Um, I also picked out caramel bread, that caramel bread pudding. Now that looks really good. But again, to me, this is mostly harvest. And I was definitely, I mean, I was on the hunt for some Christmas scent. Um, and I also picked out brownie pecan pie. And let's see, did I get any more? I feel like I'm missing some because there's no way I would have walked out of Walmart with just these four. Okay, here's another one. Um, this is Incense and Evergreen. I think I might burn this first because I do have my Scentsies going. And I've been dying to bust out these babies. All right, we were able to find a bigger one. And this is the Great Value Miracle Cleaning Eraser. And this is 12. Um, the Mr. Clean, which I absolutely prefer, they only come in a six pack. And I go through these like crazy when I'm cleaning. So this is my preferred. I mean, I prefer this over any type of scrubber. So we picked up those. And I also grabbed another of the Lysol Brand New Day, the automatic toilet cleanser. I have, this is mango and hibiscus. We have like, I think last time we went, we bought like two or three, so I have like two or three in my bathroom right now. I'm sorry, under the cabinet. I also picked up scrubbing bubbles, foaming bleach. I absolutely love this stuff for my um, shower. And bathroom grime fighter, powerful, clean, no harsh smells. Another one, and then of course, I needed the daily shower cleaner. Now, I don't know how how you, you know, how everyone rolls or does their bathrooms, but I spray all three of these um when we are done in the morning taking our showers and I let them sit in my shower in the tub and stuff all day long and then it, and then it gets cleaned because I cannot stand a grimy shower. It's just to me that's just gross. And I needed some more allergy equate. I did have to open it up because um, I needed my allergy meds. So I, I could not wait. Anyways, we always get the twin pack for the allergies. And now I can put one in my purse and put one on my nightstand. And let's see what else we picked up. All right. Um, again, the, this is the my preferred equate, the five blade, three disposable razors. I picked these up monthly. And... We needed Reynolds wrap, and so 150 feet of this, I think this was like $6, but the stuff at the 99 was just not cutting it, so we just bit the bullet and bought it at Walmart. Um, I think that's honestly all we got. It was, okay, even though this is all we got, this still was $75, but I also did get a really cute sweatshirt, which I think I showed you, but I'll show you guys again. All right, I did get this adorable sweatshirt for only $9.99. I absolutely love it. I've only worn it once, and I need to wear this more. It is so comfortable, and there's only like six days left of Christmas, so I'm going to be busting out all my Christmas stuff. All right, I ordered this, and I ordered a large, thinking it would be, I don't know, a tiny large, because it was... It did, it said that it was made in China. And so I read the reviews and people said, you know, order up a size, blah, blah, blah. And this thing is huge. This shirt is huge. So now I really don't know what I'm going to do. Um, the only thing I can think of is if I tie it at my waist, I can kind of wear it as a short top because this thing is huge. 
Um, I just opened it up right now to show you, and I thought it was going to be like a cute little t-shirt, but no, this is, this is definitely not Junior's. This is a woman's large. All right, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm either going to have my mother-in-law, we're going to cut some of this off and taper it, and make it into a little crop shirt. I think, yeah, I'm going to crop top this, baby. All right. You all know I had to get this because when I saw this online, I was like, oh my gosh. And then it says, just call me queen. And it is black and pink. I was like, oh, I need this. I had to have it. So of course I did get it. All right. And this was from Amazon. I'm not, I'm, I don't know. I think it was like $19.99 and I have Amazon Prime, so you don't pay for shipping. So yeah, it arrived the next day. Really simple, really easy. Okay, funny story about these right here. These my mother-in-law gave me and I loved them and I showed them to you before. Well, I also let you know that my old car had gotten broken into and that they had taken some stuff. Well, for whatever reasons, they took my pajamas. They were brand new in like this. And they were in my old SUV and they took them. So my husband, I would not stop griping about <laughs> my pajamas. So my husband was like, all right. I mean, he didn't tell me this, but he said, I have a surprise for you. And he handed me this, which means he ordered this and, you know, you just drive and pick up. Well, he got tired of hearing me, you know, harping about my pajamas and he went online and he found them at a Target and it took a couple days for it to arrive at that particular Target because for some reason, these are really popular. Um, when these came across my Instagram, I didn't even know my mother-in-law had bought me a pair, but I wanted them even though they're $24.99, but she got them for $15.99, she's a smart shopper. And my husband did pay $24.99 plus tax because he didn't want to hear me nagging <laughs> and talking about these pajamas anymore. So this is my second pair and I'm not going to lose these. And I plan on wearing these like Christmas Eve and Christmas day. Cause they're just so cute. They're absolutely adorable. And I don't know who they're by. Let's see. I think this is like, I don't know, Susan something Are stars stars above. Anyways, so that is, this is the second pair that's come to this house and I'm not losing, I mean, they're not getting stolen. And this, yeah, I'm disappointed, but you know what? Um, hey, stuff happens, right? All right, and also let me show you what we are going to be giving to my sister and her husband. Actually, I mean, this is what my husband picked out for them. He went to Costco and he liked this for my sister and her husband because they are huge Starbucks fans. So we did get them the 16 ounce um, travel, I guess this is called ho holiday travel um, mug gift set. It includes peppermint hot cocoa mix, um, shortbread cookies, and Starbucks. And then, of course, you get these really awesome cups. And he did get these at Costco. I'm not sure how much he paid for them. And I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I want to tell you guys. Nope, I think that's it. All right, my friends. I know a lot of you that these are my most unpopular videos are, are my collective hauls, but I still film them anyways because I do like to share every a lot of different aspects of my life, not just the 99s and not just walkthroughs. So I do appreciate the people that do take the time to watch. And I appreciate each and every single friend of the channel. And I will be back on, not today, but later on this weekend to kind of close out, um, just to kind of talk to you all. Yeah, you know, um, usually, I, well, actually, I'll probably be doing that on New Year's Eve. Um, I do like to close out our year and let you know how the channel did and just really thank everyone. But um, anyways, I'm going to end this. As always, have a great day or a great evening, and I will be back tomorrow. Who knows where we will be at, although I have a really good idea because, well, you know what? Just going to surprise you all. All right, my friends. Thank you so much.